Hey guys, so this is your tutorial to help you out with your Punnett Square worksheet. This example here that you're seeing with the freckles and no freckles is the same one as number one on your worksheet. So you're going to take what you see here, you're going to transport it onto your worksheet, and then complete the rest of the worksheet on your own. So to start off, this is what a Punnett square looks like, four boxes. Here I've shown you two genotypes with two alleles, dominant F, dominant F, and another genotype over here with two alleles, recessive F, recessive F. The allele is the letter by itself, so this allele is a dominant F, which indicates freckles. This allele is a recessive F, which indicates no freckles. So the very first thing you want to do is you want to take your genotypes and put them on the Punnett square. So we're going to put a dominant F here and a dominant F here, coming from over here. Then I'm going to take the two recessives and put them on the side. Once you've done that, you can carry out the cross. You bring the top two alleles down. So I'm going to put a dominant down. And I'm going to bring the other genotype, or the other two alleles, across. Now we know that if the dominant allele is showing in the gene expression, that means that the dominant allele or the dominant um, trait, with the, which are the freckles and the no freckles, the dominant trait being the freckles is showing in the phenotype, which is physically shown. So in this outcome, you'll notice that all four of the possible offspring are going to have that dominant F, which indicates that all four are going to have freckles. So it is a four to four fraction of having dominant recessive genotype, which indicates freckles. Or you can say it's 100% freckles. Or it is a 4 to 4 ratio of freckles. So for your homework tonight, you have to indicate all the ratios, all the fractions, and all the percents. Also indicate to me the allele the trait, and then you have to complete the Punnett square by showing all of the offspring. Good luck!